Hello my friends, it's Krebs here, and today I've got a really cool match to show you in World of Tanks. Uh, it's, it's nothing like what I usually do where, oh, I got a first class mastery, I got an ace tanker, uh, nothing like that, but it's actually something funny that happens towards the end, and I really want to build it up here, so, uh, you'll have to watch the, the entire replay just, just to get a feel of what's going to happen, and don't worry, it's not, it's not too long, it's only about, what is that, four minutes, five minutes, I'm sure you guys can probably see on the video, video uh, timer thing, but okay, let's let's get down to it. All right, so I've got a I've got a game. I'm in my tiger. I'm platooned up with Nebu, and we're on Himmelsdorf. So uh, it's a higher tier match, and so I'm thinking to myself, no point of going up on the hill. And same with Nebu, we decided we're just going to focus elsewhere. Hopefully, the uh, weaker tanks uh, will be down here on the rest of the map, whilst the higher tier ones are going to have their joust or whatever up up north and. Lucky me, already getting off a shot on the enemy there. I didn't actually pay attention what that was. But, was it Type 62? I think it might have been. Something like that. Uh, so luckily already getting a shot off, and now we're moving down along the line. When I saw one of my teammates get shot from the back, and I'm thinking to myself, where the hell did that come from? And the WC, so out of place. <laughs> I can totally understand the flanking idea behind it. But that just came down like a, like a ton of bricks on top of him. Uh, it turned around on him, backfired, he got cornered, and yeah, we finished him off. So I'm thinking, okay, maybe I can get another shot off here. Yep, that's what I needed. Got some more damage out on one of the enemy tanks over here. And now, time to focus my efforts elsewhere. Whilst, if you look on the map, on the hill, it's not looking kind of too good, is it? It kind of looks like our guys are getting swarmed, and and as soon as something like that is happening, usually you know, yeah, something bad is gonna happen. When they're attacking you from two different directions or more than uh, a single direction, yeah, not, not, not a good idea. Nothing's probably gonna good come out of that for our team. So uh, we're getting massacred up up there, whilst the rest of the map is pretty much in our hands. I, I see a T50 is gonna come up along here. Fire animus. Uh, by the way, this is actually part of the new patch, so they did the accuracy changes and all that stuff. Uh, really cool, maybe I'll do a separate video about it in the future. Probably, actually probably I won't because there's not going to be any point doing it in a few days time, but anyway, focus down on T50, do some massive damage, he's almost dead. And I'll look at that up there, there's a whole bunch of enemy tanks up, up on top of the hill, and none of our allied tanks, they're all moving down towards the VP point, the victory point, uh-oh, uh-oh, okay, right, let's think about this right now, we're winning by four kills, however, that is a lot of their heavies up there that are coming down here, and really, really fast, they're high tiers, alright, so it's kind of a scary moment, it's like, uh, we could win this by victory points, but, uh, they could easily come around speeding like a bullet, damage some of the guys inside the victory point and we're gonna lose all those points and so this is when I take it upon myself I'm saying to Nebu right now okay action plan I am going to go do something about it you're gonna see it in just a second here we go so my tiger I'm rolling it on up I can see that the enemies are speeding around just past the uh, middle of the northern portion of the map no idea where this M103 is because he's the first tank coming around here he is here he is here he is here he is Oh! <laughs> he, he ricocheted! He ricocheted right off of me. I took a big shot from uh, one of the enemies, but as you can tell what I'm doing, I'm blocking them from getting to our victory point. Detracking the Tiger 2. The, the, is that a Tiger 2 E75? Oh god, I always get confused about them. And there we go, another enemy stopped, and lo and behold, the victory points have been saved. So, I can't really say if... I can't really tell if they would have won or if uh, we would have won anyway, even if I didn't block them. Uh, I mean, it was something like, what, 30, 40, something like that, VPs left. So maybe they could have gone around that corner and reset them, and that would have been annoying. And who knows what the outcome could have been. We were still leading, but they still had a lot of high-tier tanks. Who knows? I took it upon myself to do the contribution of doing the suicidal blocker. Yeah, <laughs> block their paths completely. If only you got some rewards for that. Uh, yeah, that's that's it. Short and sweet. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, this is Krebs, and I will catch you all later.